Which two secret voices do you want to see lip syncing now? So I'm going to match up the dog walker. Just first impressions was he's a bad singer. And then Hollywood starlet. Um, just stage presence, the way she looks. Um, I can see her being a good singer. OK. Oh, oh, all right. OK. So give it up for a dog walker and Hollywood starlet. Chain, 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 chain of fools for five long years. I fought to win my man. Wow. Chain, 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 chain of fools. Oh. Did the, um, the day of my life with the blackjack dealer. The dog walker, I really don't know anything about. So I think my best bet is to interrogate the dog walker. Yes. OK, Rick, your 30 seconds starts in three, two, one, go. Do you have any musical uh, superstitions? Uh, I always pray before performance. What kind of singer would you classify yourself as? Pop R&B. Which famous musicians do you admire? Jennifer Hudson, Clark Sisters. What is your go-to playlist? Jennifer Hudson, Clark Sisters, Jasmine Sullivan. Do you prefer to sing alone or with a band? With a band behind me. Where was your first performance? Urban Pop Showcase, Belmont University. What do you do after a performance? Decompress. D -d Celebrate it. Wow. He didn't talk fast enough. <laughs> I'm not really sure if it was super helpful or not. Hopefully. I mean, Adrian seems like she's pretty blown away by something, so. He had the raspy voice that we heard in the lip sync challenge. And I'm sorry, but anyone that pulls out Jasmine Sullivan and the Clark sisters, yeah, I agree. Yeah, yeah. you Clark's, got, that's you so got specific. all kinds of vocals yeah. in that body. I agree. That was a very specific, yeah. you know, uh, choice. Also, I thought it was interesting that he decompresses. That's a very artist thing, where, like, after Big Show. So I think the dog walker is a good singer. I disagree. I did not love the decompress. You didn't? No, Why? because of course everyone wants to decompress after something special. I'm gonna need to. I want to know that somebody like goes in a closet and closes it so they can <laughs> have some quiet and some darkness or something specific. I would totally say decompress. But how do you wind down? I mean, you go in a closet. I literally have to sit and allow the energy to like come okay, down. Okay, well that makes sense. <laughs> I wouldn't go into that really, I don't think. Does anybody else go in the closet? I've never been in the closet. <laughs> That was joyous. Rick, it's time to make a decision. Who do you think is a bad singer? Blackjack dealer? Oh my gosh. Or dog walker? Okay, the one thing I noticed about his answers, and maybe it was just me, but he seemed really nervous. I'm just doubting if dog walker, he's an actual performer, if he would be that nervous just answering questions. But the one thing I keep going back to is I don't think the blackjack dealer related to Steven Tyler. Ugh. I think I'm gonna, I'm, I think I'm going to overthink this, so I think I'm just going to go with my gut, and I'm going to eliminate the blackjack dealer, and I'm going to lock it in. Dog Walker, go get ready because after this, you'll be singing with Leanne Rhymes. Yes. Welcome back to I Can See Your Voice. We are down to our last secret voice, Dog Walker. Rick, it's time for you to make your final and biggest decision of all. All game long, you've been trying to find and eliminate the bad singers so that a good singer is left standing up there to duet with Leanne Rhymes. And so now, for the first time in the game, you're hoping Dog Walker is a good singer. But here's the decision you have to make. You can either walk away with the $30,000 guaranteed to go home with some real life-changing money, or you can play on for one final round, and if Dog Walker turns out to be a good singer, your winnings will shoot up to $100,000. However, if you get it wrong, and Dog Walker turns out to be a bad singer, 
you'll go home with nothing. Panel? This is a rough one. Look, I think he's a good singer. I would take that gamble. But then again, I've been wrong, 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 wrong. <laughs> I think when he did the lip sync, he moved the microphone away before he finished the note, which was strange to me. He does not feel like a sure thing to me. If I were you, I would take my money. I, are you a risky guy? Like, do you like to? Usually, yes. But I've never been in the situation where there's thirty thousand dollars right now. Yeah, it's different than just you know trying a new coffee drink. This right. is a big thing. <laughs> I think that he is a good singer, but if you're not sure, take the money and run. I've been wrong a lot today, and so as much as I believe with my whole heart because of the Clark sisters that he is a good singer, I can't tell you to gamble $30,000 on that. Right. His voice, his speaking voice, did sound a lot like his singing voice. Yeah. I think he's a good singer. I would gamble it all. So Rick, you've heard from the panel. Which way are you leaning? Uh, I know when I left, I, I talked to my kids. Uh, my six-year-old tells me, Daddy, you gotta risk it for the biscuit, he tells me. Oh. But he's also six, <laughs> so it's easy for him to say. Um, I'm doing this to put some money to make an indoor practice facility for the youth sports. So um, it would be really hard to walk away from $30,000. Um, I just, with that saying that, I just, I can't. It's obviously a big decision. Um, I think I'm just gonna take the money. I'm gonna lock it in. Rick, you've been a great contestant tonight. You have won $30,000. Give it up for Rick. But I am sure you and America would love to find out what would have happened had you played on Leanne, please go and join Dog Walker on the Stage of Truth for the Grand Duet Finale. So Rick, I will remind you that if Dog Walker is a good singer, you would have taken home $100,000. But if he's a bad singer, your money is safe because you are leaving with the $30,000 instead of nothing. Singing Can't Fight the Moonlight, Please put your hands together for Leanne Rhymes and Dog Walker. Under a love sky, gonna be with you, and no one's gonna be around. If you think that you will fall with the sweet and sweet. or something would have been, you know. <laughs> You're leaving California with $30,000. That's insane. That's major. Rick, I think you should feel great. You'll I be do. glad that you walked home with me. I do. You were yeah. thinking about kids that need a place to spend their winters doing something. I agree. I think you did the right thing. You're still taking home $30,000. Rick, everybody. I want to thank Adrian Houghton, Cheryl Hines, Mario Cantone, Melissa Peterman.
Leanne Rhymes. Thank you so much. And also Triumphian Soap Comic Dog. Thank you guys for watching. Good night, everybody.